Two, one. Hi, I'm Eva Gardner. Today I'm going to give you a tour of a slice of an animal cell in Miss Hopkins' fourth block class. Some of the ways to tell the differences between animal and plant cells are because plant cells have chloroplasts, the cell wall, and vacuoles, which animal cells do not have. Another way to identify the difference differences is that plant cells are more of a rectangular shape and animal cells have more of a circular shape. The nucleus's job is in an animal cell is to manufacture ribosomes. In this case, you can see the cutout of the nuclear membrane which protects the nucleus by controlling which substance enter and leave it. The mitochondria uses glucose to produce, store, and release ATP. The job of the endoplasmic reticulum is to transport all the nutrients. The ribosome's job is to synthesize proteins and amino acids. The cell membrane is selectively permeable allowing only certain things into the cell. The job of the cytoplasm is the gel-like substance that contains all the organelles. And last but not least, the lysosome contains special protein digesting en enzymes.